One of the big things fairgoers look forward to every year is the food. I'm Charity Nebbe, host of Iowa Ingredient, and the fair atmosphere seems to give us all license to indulge in something truly decadent. There are the classics like corn dogs and funnel cakes, but every year the fair makes room for some new delicacies. The fair features more than 200 food stands and well over 50 different types of food on a stick. You have a good chance of finding a great meal at the Iowa State Fair. And not everything is deep fried. I, I, can't, I come here to eat my way through the fair. I've been doing it for uh, <clears throat> close to 60 years now, so. This year, eight concessionaires submitted culinary delights in the new foods contest. Three new foods beat out the rest of the finalists. A bacon-wrapped riblet on a stick, a strawberry smoothie on a stick, and a shrimp corn dog on a stick. Well, when you're at the fair, everything has to be on a stick. And so we had to be a little bit creative to find a way that we could get into the on a stick craze. Mm. It is good. Got strawberries, a little bit of sugar, water, ice, and that's it. Can we get two of the shrimp corn dogs? Yeah. We came all the way from the Quad Cities, Bettendorf, Iowa, just to eat these shrimp on a, uh, corn dogs. They're awesome. Yes, this is yeah. our first stop. About a month ago, I sent her the article that said like the top new items to try, and this was the one that we had to try. We go every year and we always try to try the new foods. Aside from the top three finalists, there are plenty of sinfully sweet treats to keep fair goers cool. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm having the coconut mountain. I don't even know what it is, but I'm having it because I love coconut. <laughs> what about you? Uh, I'm, I'm definitely trying her coconut thing. <laughs> <laughs> we try to come up with something new every year uh, and have fun during the, uh, the off season, so to speak. Uh, you know, trying to come up with new products. So coconut mountain was what we came up with. If you're trying to find that taste of Rome at the fairgrounds, then Parlo Pizza will be your destination. Were you a little scared about scaling up to fair level of production so fast? Yeah, we you know, weren't sure what to expect out here, but uh, uh, our setting is nice. We've got the wine and cheese garden up here and lots of kids with the grape stomping. So, uh, you know, kids like cheese pizza and we, we got enough, last for the fair. <laughs> These personal-sized pizzas come loaded with wonderful ingredients like fresh mozzarella, sweet peppers, and basil. We haven't had one complaint ever about the food. It was the least thing I had to worry about when we were doing this startup operation. Uh, the food just kind of takes care of itself. Adventurous fairgoers are finding a lot to love with this year's new fair foods. I said, oh my gosh, we may have to have two days because I can't eat all this in one day. <laughs> uh, I think anything that I'm trying at that moment is the best thing. Exactly. So right now, this is, this is the best. 